Anything will do, from craft dinner, to cereal, to canned fruit. A feast for a post-secondary student. Tuesday marked the ending of Trick or Eat, an annual food drive organized by the College's Student Council. The week before, volunteers from the school dispersed throughout the neighborhoods surrounding the college and dropped off empty brown bags with a note attached, a plea to help feed less fortunate students. The final step was collecting the goods. SRC President Kate Isley and Director Luis Hurtado, students themselves, say it's a great way to help their peers. So typically it's one student that volunteers their time in a car and then two other students will go with them and essentially we go to that area or neighborhood and we just drive down the street nice and slow um, and two people run out and grab the bags and then bring them back and throw them in the car. Uh, for me personally I've been in uh, times of need as well and I've had these options available to me uh, so being able to give back is a, is a is a good way of uh, saying, hey, I was there once, uh, I can help out now. So. The event began more than 10 years ago and is still meeting demand today. The campus food bank usually helps around 75 students throughout the year. I just want to say thank you so much to everyone who's involved because without our volunteers and without um, all of the neighborhoods, neighbors that helped donate, we wouldn't have this program. The shelves are stocked for the school year ahead. Rick Dawes, MediaPlex News.